Nobody knows she's gone, you know. They were all she was 14. Yeah, but, but she wasn't like most 14 year olds. She didn't know. This is stupid. You're stupid. You're a, a, a stupid, stupid. You what? I wish I hadn't done it, Lee. Do you? If that's any consolation. It isn't. She was like a doll. She was like a, a cute little blonde thing, and I just. <sighs> did you get your lunch? Yeah, I did. Yeah, what did you have? I had roast beef and roast potatoes and gravy and peas and carrots and cauliflower. Oh, you wouldn't get that if you were still at home, would you? I don't think so, no. Is that the main reason you left, do you think? For your dinners? Do you really think you deserve this place? Oh, I don't know. Is that why you keep it so fucking clean? Danny. Do you blame Mum and Dad for what's happening to you? Is it genetic, do you think? Don't you start swearing your head off again. You have no idea what I'm going through. <laughs> I spend my nights watching reruns of The Simpsons. Well, I have videos of Mork and Mindy that I watch sometimes. And... And I spend my days trawling through sex contact pages on the internet. So don't you tell me I don't know what you're going through. Because I live what you're going through. And I never did anything like that. Did you go and see Marley? I did, yes. I told you not to go. I know. You liked her, didn't you? I did, yes. You liked her a bit too much, I think. She would never have you though, would she, Danny? You're completely deluding yourself. I'm so much cleverer than you. In real life. It's embarrassing. When you're on the television, I was incredulous. You could hardly finish your sentences. It's important to believe we're making a difference. People have no idea what life's like here in Saddam's regime. <laughs> Thing is, Mum and Dad were extremely proud of you. They'd have arguments over which one you took after and which one I took after. He's ashamed of me. Dad. Which is ironic. <laughs>